Welcome to my first Traxxas TRX 6 crawling session. Just a few little tests around the yard today guys. Nothing too strenuous, but I have a feeling not a lot is going to stop the Traxxas TRX 6. Lots more planned for TRX over the fall season. So if you don't want to miss those videos, then don't forget to subscribe. Anyway, let's get to it. Time to take the TRX-6 out for its first run around the yard. I've plugged the lights in. I've not read the instructions as yet, but it looks like you've got four sockets here, and it looks like it goes in across that way. And I've been turned it on. We're good to go with the lights. I say, high gear test. Now, I know from seeing people driving this and testing it, if you turn at full speed, the truck will tip over, and I don't want to damage that new body. First time out, now low gear. That's flat out in low gear there. And you can turn on full throttle in low gear without any problem at all. Steering radius, guys. I've got it in, in high gear at the minute, but with all the diffs unlocked, so we'll go full lock. So I say that's with all the diffs unlocked. Now, lock one of them. And you see already that's increased the steering radius on there. Now look all the diffs. And that's increased it even more as you would expect on this car. But I just thought that might be useful for people to uh, see what a difference it makes. So that's with everything locked. Everything unlocked. You can see much, much tighter with everything unlocked. Now I'm fully expecting this to motor over pretty much anything. Ooh. Now, I will lock all the discs. We're in low gear. Pulls up over that without any problem at all. Now, somebody mentioned how could it, would it, it be at side healing? Well, let me just see. Well, not too bad at all going up there. Anyway find something a bit more challenging. So that's decent enough speed and flat out and low gear there. Now I spotted something earlier, which most of my cars struggle with, but this may have the power to get up. And that has just marched over that, guys. Highly, highly impressive from the outset there. That's where that extra axle, the traction that is giving, is winning out there. Now will we descend as well? Drop down. No problems at all. Just check out that articulation. A little bit more speed on there. And we made it up there without any problem. Now, that's with all the diff locks on there. That's not bad turning on that low surface. Descending. Now, I have no idea which mode the ESC is set in here, guys. Whether it is set in crawl mode, in terms of that drag brake on there, or not. Something I will need to read up on the manual in there.
Not bad though. Not bad at all. First thoughts are, it's got plenty of torque and punch for when you want it on there. Seems to be holding its own on its, uh, some people are worried about the body taking the thing over on its side. I'll probably prove that while they're immediately tipping it over now, but that's not bad there to my mind guys, not bad at all. Awesome traction everywhere. And it steers far, far better than I thought it would do. I thought with that longer wheelbase on here, it might struggle. Far from it. I think this is gonna be very potent out there on the trail. Very. I think they may have come up with another winner here. Well, people, I am Highly impressed with my new Traxxas TRX6. It turns a lot, lot better than I thought it would do, even with all the diffs locked. Well, there we have it. That's my first crawl with the Traxxas TRX6. Hope you liked it. Hope you like the color I've chosen. I've gone for the uh, gray as opposed to the black it comes in. Loving the LED headlights with it, and this should prove excellent for crawling at night. Speaking of which, I might try and go for a little night crawl over the weekend. So, if you don't want to miss the upcoming videos I've got planned for the Traxxas TRX6, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Well, thumbs up if you like this video, guys. Post any comments you might have in the comment section below the video, and hit the circle below to subscribe. And if you do hit the circle, don't forget to hit the bell.